Welcome back, viewer, to Let's Play Wasteland. We are outside of Needles, so let's go in. Yes, fun to be had by all, and will be had. Leather jerk. Tired of jerks. Get out of here. You and... Nah. Anyway. I was going to say something clever, but it didn't work out for me. You know how that is. It happens sometimes. A heavy, musty smell fills the ammo bunker. Puddles of blood splash when you step in them. You can easily tell that no one comes here very often. Well, then how did the blood get there if nobody comes here? This used to be a very powerful artillery piece. Too bad it is broken in several places. Uh, is that a living person? Uh, let's see... You find a ruby ring and a blood staff. The M3 rat that used to be here left a long time ago to fight against the invaders. I'm guessing that's like a. Oh, there you go. A rusted pile of wires and armor plating are all that remain of an M3 Reagan all terrain hover tank. Uh, wow. Well. Thanks for the advice. I might get cut by the metal pieces. In this game, I wouldn't be surprised if it was possible. So, there are several old ammo clips and even an old power pack on the shelves. On the shelves there are several stacks of TNT. The stuff is so old it will blow up if you stand, if you stand too close. Let's not do that. Uh, let's see. Loki? Let's see, let's give some 7.622 millimeter clips there, and uh, for Ace, some 9 millimeter clips, and uh, Loki can have a power pad, and uh, well, that's it, we'll leave that for later. See, these shelves have some very mean looking grenades and some ugly gray lumps of plastic explosives. Someone with the right skill will have to disarm this very dangerous booby trap. Use uh, three skill. Not demolitions. Uh, let's see. Bomb disarm. Oh. Smokey bear. Okay. Reload the game! Haha, <laughs> who said I had any integrity? Uh, you did it! Gee, you were good at that. Maybe you should go adventuring with a skill like that. Right. I'd say don't go getting ahead of yourself. Alright. Uh, old bloody, bloody robes lay on the shelves. Nice. Tanks and artillery shells. There might even be one left. A howitzer shell. We'll take that. So, not terribly... Let's see, uh, sure that we'll be able to use that for much, but... That'd be nice. So, we've got the police station over here. Let's go in there. Uh, one-way cell doors. There's no way to open them from this side. We'll see about that. A wimpy robot clerk s sits behind a desk, swamped with paperwork. Yeah, it demands ir 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 irately. Uh, neighborhood watch tips? It checks you a neighborhood watch pamphlet and goes straight back to its work. Read paragraph 104. I knew I forgot something. And what did I forget? I forgot the paragraph book. Where is that? Here it is. Hopefully it... So that'll take a moment to pop up. 104. It's a good thing I keep everything on my handy-dandy cluttered desktop. 
And yes, if you are wondering, that is a map of out of uh, wasteland there, of the outdoors of wasteland on my desktop. The pamphlet contains two tips for the wise. One, buy an AK-97 assault rifle. Two, if there's someone hanging around your neighborhood you don't know, shoot him. That's my kind of survival guide. Or anyway, me and the game. Uh, Robo Clerk. Point of Detective. The wimpy clerk checks a notebook and says, You're lucky. He's free right now. Follow the hallway. It's the first door on the left. Well, go on. Okay. Uh, let's see. Do you perception? Counter? Yes. Alright. We didn't want to attack him or anything. I was just wondering if we talk to him or something. I don't know. Uh, you see nothing special. Let's see. What we see? Spam shade. It's better than sham spade. He sees your ruby ring. Read paragraph 158. 158. Where'd you get that ring? The detective demands. I think His Holiness is looking for that thing. Nice job of uh, not putting on the other quotation marks, but whatever. Well, he's going to have to wait. Going back to his work, Sam says, I suppose you want to know about the blood staff. Read paragraph 29. Good God. 29. Right. Here we are. Oh, it's a lengthy one. Going back to work, Sam says, I suppose you want to know about the blood staff. He wipes his hands on a greasy rag and sighs. Don't mind telling you, the murders have lots of folks worried. People just up and vanish. Then, when we find them again, they've been drained of blood. Every drop. He squints at you, and his voice drops to a tense whisper. I seen one of the bodies, and it had a cut in the neck. Just like a scar my grandmother had on her neck. She said once, when she was little, a priest used the blood staff on her after, after she got snake bit. I think the blood staff is involved, and that means trouble. Uh, are you sure your grandma isn't a vampire who's now terrorizing the town? Just wondering. Alarm bells on the wall. What are these prisoners, I guess? Right. Wait, what? This affair. Solid brick. Very closed. Cell doors closed. Lots of closed cell doors. Beware of attack cops. Right. Barracks with space for 25 robot cops. A lot of angry looking robo cops are coming your way. We don't want that. Ah. Okay. Oh, whoops. It's a lot of robo cops. Oh, they're not gonna just give up now, huh? Uh, well, they're not gonna chase us. I'm guessing there's cops in there too. Nobody in this cell. These are all cells. Ah, huh, young punks with mohawks, huh? Whatever. I'm not worried about that. And they die. It is resisting our efforts. Oh, the skill checks. The horrible, horrible skill checks. But I didn't get a point of skill when I did it. 